one in four young people do not finish year 12. Some of them recover their education, but about 15% never do and may face lifelong disadvantage. 41,000 young people experience homelessness and go to homelessness services in Australia in a, in a given year. In Geelong, 250 or so young people leave school early every year. About 230 front up and seek help for homelessness, and that's been going on for a decade until recently. And then, of course, there's young people who get uh, involved in drug and alcohol issues and mental health and so on. So we really need to face the challenge of what do we do to help our young people these days? What do we need to do? What do communities need to do? The Geelong Project, or what we call the Community of Schools and Youth Services model, the COS model, is a genuine collaboration between agencies, schools, including the university and in Geelong, the local learning employment network, Headspace for Mental Health, in a deep collaboration to change the local service system. So identifying problems early, responding in a different way, having a very strong commitment to outcomes. That's very different from the existing service system. And if we're honest, many of our existing programs are nowhere near working well enough. What I think the model has achieved, what we have achieved, is that we have, over three years, reduced the young people entering the homeless system by 40%. That is unprecedented and, I believe, an absolute first in this country or anywhere else. We've also, at the same time, and equally importantly, we've reduced the number of early school leavers, the number of young people uh, leaving their education by 20%. So these are substantial achievements of a model that actually works.